Well, what? we've collected oh the gold God. card, and so now there's going to be a PDA that we use to spy on this guy, as you'll find out later. What? Now, did you, you haven't even played this game. How do you even? You go to the bank. Yeah, I know that. I was trying to find the city. So I don't like danger by design this. I think it's down here. No places with the eyes or where you go. Yeah. And here's the bank. You need this later, so I'm sorry. Bird seed. Okay, go turn off the light. No, this. We've done the first video like this, so now we have to do the whole thing like this. Okay. And you enter the card. <laughs> now. It has some. Uh, it has some information. And some file on then it. You Here, stop shaking your chair. And the instructions say to get a. Uh, to get the PDA in. Uh, spy on Antonio. Demetrius and you get binoculars and, and a PDA. this is the PDA so what you have to do now what would be good to do now is to test the PDA Ciao, this is Nancy Drew Yes, is this Detective Leborace? See, si, but please, to you I am just Sophia I'll remember that, Sophia Why do you call? Can I be watching Fungo? He's not in his office I know. I just wanted to make sure this PDA thing works. It is from the GDIF. Military equipment is good. But you are smart to test it, Nancy. And you are good to help us. We are very short-handed. Carnevale keeps the police very busy. I just hope I can help. Remember, when you have seen Fongo do something of interest, call me. Ciao. And that's... Well, Sophia. Ciao. So yes, that is Sophia. Ciao, we're gonna get ready to go to dinner. Okay, cool. And what you need to do is go back to Kanas Costa, which is where she Kanas Costa. That's how it's pronounced. <gasps> That's my pager. Antonio Fongo is in his office. Time to go to work. You heard him, Nancy. No. And she's kind of weird, but let's spy on him. He is in the building, Argon. And she does not know where to look, but there's Antonio Fongo. Nancy, what oh, are you doing? Uh, spying on someone. Uh, Studying the architecture. That's what I want to be, an architect. So I'm kind of boning up. You Americans always busy doing something. Que noia. This is kind of boring. He has a huge bald spot. Drinking his coffee. Doing what farmers do. It's actually really boring. Uh, do something, Fongo. Uh, well, he sure likes his coffee. Let's try this again. She looks at the sign. Okay, we'll go shut the door. Still doing what Antonio Fongo does. Wait a second. What if he's drinking a bit too much coffee? See? One, two, three, four, five. Well, look, we'll go back six, to him later. Oh, wait. Seven. What is this? This looks interesting. Office. I better go somewhere private and call Sophia. He removed 
something from the pigeon's leg. You are positive? Yes, he removed something, kind of studied it, then left the office. Maybe he is using a trained pigeon to communicate with someone. Yes, this could be true, because we know that by phone he talks to almost no one. Here is what we will do. I will deliver to you a tracking device. You will sneak into Fang's office when he is not there and feed it to the pigeon. After that, you can use your PDA to see in what direction it has flown. You want me to feed a tracking device to a pigeon? It will be very, very tiny, but I do not want to leave it at the ATM. If you go there too much, people will get suspicious. So we will leave it for you in the costume store in Campo Santa Maria Famosa. It will be hidden among the things there. You will have to find it. How will I know what it looks like? Very soon, I will send a picture of it to your PDA. But you must locate the device quickly. If you do not find it in time, it will destroy itself. If that happens, we will hide another device. Your PDA will show you where we have hidden it. You want me to feed a tracking device that self-destructs to a pigeon? The self-destruct mechanism will automatically deactivate when you pick it up. And do not worry. The device will not hurt the pigeon after it is swallowed. Well, then I guess I'm on my way to Campo Santa Maria Formosa. After you have fed the tracking device to the pigeon, you must do two things. You must find out where the pigeon goes when it leaves Fungo, and you must discover what it is carrying. Call me when you know these things. Ciao! And that's our chat. A phone, and this is the famous... Hello! Hello, Miss Nancy? Miss Rutherford, yes, it's Nancy. How are you? But to be honest, I'm rather peeved. Were you or were you not to call me just as soon as you were settled in there at the car? I'm sorry, I should have called, but I've been very busy. And I've been very worried. I was afraid Margarita had allowed my beloved Carnes ghost to fall into such a state of disrepair that it was no longer habitable. Oh, no, no, the car is fine. Oh, that's a relief. So, how goes the case? Captain Brassica said he was going to send you a parcel. Has it arrived? Yes, it sure has. Good. The sooner you get to work, the better. I talked you up quite a bit, you know. Both the GDIF and the local gendarmerie are expecting great things from you. As am I. No one wants this phantom scoundrel captured more than I do. I'm flattered, Miss Rutherford, and I'll do my best. But it's not like I'm a superhero or anything. Like I told you, I just like solving mysteries. Just see that you solve this one in a timely fashion, dear. We leave on a cruise in two weeks, and I shan't be able to enjoy a second of it until I know all those stolen works of art have been recovered. I'll let you get back to whatever it is you're doing. As it happens, I'm oh, writing my gosh. memoirs. They shall be called The Principles of Prudence. Unfortunately, this has necessitated my hiring an assistant. You really must stop thinking bad thoughts about Ginger. Yes, you are. Just look how she's shaking. The other day, poor Ginger mistook the shapeless lump of leather my assistant called her purse for a doggy toy and ripped it to shreds. She's still a bit perturbed. Although, believe you me, Ginger did her a massive favor. Anyway, if you ever cannot reach me, it means we are hard at work. The bunch Okay, that was very strange. We need, okay, we can't get them yet. I don't know why, but... We have to lock the door. I don't really care. Okay, if you die, we have to go to... Campadu. I'm not sure it's that one. And the pin is hidden here. I think. Yeah. Really tiny, I don't even know where it is. Do you know where it is? Okay. Here. Oh, is it right here? And we got it. I guess it looks like a white thing, I guess. White pill? Can we get, oh, those are expensive. What we need to do now is go back to the car and get some bobby pins. No, 
keep doing that. And get some bobby pins from your closet. And I cannot get them. I don't think it's supposed to be bobby pins. No, we just go. No. This is where Antonio Fongo is. We are going to do. Looks like I'm going to have to pick this lock somehow. And that is going to do it. We'll find out how to get in next.